Ebola also can be called Ebola hemorrhagic fever, a virus that causes severe bleeding, organ failure, and can lead to death. Hello, dear Lily Sarah of Buera Online TV. I welcome you once again on Buera Online TV. Kindly subscribe, like, comment, and share. Big of all, don't forget to leave your mark for the peace. Tonight, we are going to talk about a popular disease that is common now in the country Uganda and that may lead to another strike of a lockdown. Human may spread Ebola virus through sweat, blood, and saliva. And these actions are kissing, hugging, shaking hands, and sharing sharp material. Signs and symptoms include fever, headache, muscle pains and chills. Later, a person may experience internal bleeding resulting in vomiting or coughing blood. People may also experience pains areas in the abdomen, chest, joints or muscles. Whole body chills, dehydration, fatigue, fever, loss of appetite, malaise or sweating. Genestrential, diarrhea, nausea, vomiting or vomiting blood. Also common, cough up blood, eye readiness, headache, mental confusion and pretasia or core throat. These are some of the ways how you can prevent yourself from getting Ebola virus. You avoid contact with blood and body fluids such as urine, feces, saliva, sweat, vomits, breast milk, amniotic fluids, semen and vagina fluids or people who are sick. Two, avoid contact with semen from man who has recovered from EVD until testing shows that the virus is gone from his body. Three, avoid contact with items that may come in contact with the infected person's body or fluids such as clothes, bedding, needles, and medical equipment. Four, avoid funeral or burial practice that involve touching the body of someone who died from EVD or suspected. Five, avoid contact with bats, forest antelopes, and non-human privates such as monkeys and chimpanzees, blood fluids or raw meat prepared from these or unknown animals, bush meat. These are prevention methods should be used when living or traveling to an area experiencing an Ebola outbreak. After returning from an area experiencing the Ebola outbreak, people should monitor their health for 21 days and seek medical care immediately if they develop symptoms of EVD or Ebola. Ebola vaccine. The U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA approved the Ebola vaccine RSV bug called Arvebo on December 19th and 19th. This is fifth FDA approved medicine. But currently in Uganda, we are facing a problem that Ebola is now rampant in Uganda, but that medicine is not yet, or that vaccine is not yet in Uganda. So, all Ugandans, this is a voice to you guys. Let us take, let us take care. Remember, if we manage to fight against COVID-19, that means Ebola war can also end soon. But if we don't take precautions, Ebola can lead us to another lockdown. Ebola can lead us to another unexpected uh, lockdown. So, guys, let us take care. Let us take care. Let us fight against Ebola. And Ebola is very dangerous. Let us follow all those things that I've mentioned above. Let us prevent ourselves from getting infected. Because if you get infected, the chances of getting healed, they are 0.9%. So guys, let us take care. Let us stay away from all these things that can bring to us that EVD. So this was Buera Online TV and I was Ram Jarafik, the celebrity boyfriend. And this was Health Tip. Let us take care. Thank you for following Buera Online TV. Like, comment, and share. Remember, you are on a health tip. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.